show y'all the oils that I'm going to be using today to essentially relax my mind. Okay, so I have the first one that I can't really pronounce. <laughs> Bergamot and lavender. Now, this is a good combo for anyone who is watching that does have high blood pressure or if you deal with things as it relates to anxiety and stress. So, I know y'all probably thinking, Unique, you're so young. How do you have high blood pressure, girl? We don't know, but I'm I'm on a quest to figure it out myself. But, um, as y'all can see, these have some great benefits. I'm trying to see. Okay. So, yes, the first one, it allows you to relax and unwind. They say that you can use this one with peppermint, and um, I used that with the peppermint before, and it worked fine for me. And then for the bergamot, I've actually been using the bergamot under my arms. <laughs> um, it's really good as a neutralizer. And the lavender, of course, that has a, a relaxing effect. So, I'm doing a combo of all three of these, and I'm just going to mix it into my diffuser here, and I love it because, like, as y'all can see, it has the light. You can check different colors, but let me put the top on so y'all can see. This is the one that I have. It was actually given to me by somebody that's really special to me, and they watch my channel, so thank you. <laughs> Oh, and I use, excuse the lighting, but it's dark in here. I use distilled water. Very important. Okay, distilled water. Let me show y'all how it works. Okay, so I usually just hit mist. And then it starts to come out. I have to shut the door because, yeah, I have to shut the door because pets, they don't do too well with, um, diffusers and then for the colors you can just hit light and y'all can see like oh, pretty color this is the one that i usually leave on and then i turn off my big light you can leave it like that where it changes colors on its own or you can pick what color you want i think that one is really pretty it's so hard to see on the camera that one's really pretty, ain't it? Ah, pink. But I usually sleep to this one. So I just turn my light off. And I have a vibe. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I'm about to call it a night. So yeah, I'll see y'all in the morning. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So I was trying to make me some detox water and I cut my fingers so bad and it's like gushing out right now.
properties in it so that'll prevent you know any type of fungus or anything coming until i can get to the doctor but yeah y'all down bad and it's probably wouldn't have been gushing out like that but i know i told y'all the other day that my pressure was up a little bit but honestly i just need to like be calm <laughs> and it's just hard to keep calm because like life is really coming at me once I can like be calm and stay calm and like stay at a relaxed and peaceful state I think I'll be okay good color in my hands i can still look at my fingers i don't think it's that serious but y'all know they in here like tripping on me about my blood pressure and i'm just telling them like i just need to be relaxed and i need to be calm like just let me get calm let me get relaxed girl the doctor came in there to check my blood pressure again i saw her i said y'all just need to give me a moment to calm down i'm gonna put on some meditation music and do some deep breathing so it can get down but it's not gonna get down to where they want it to be and i'm not taking any medicine because it's just it's not gonna help it's just gonna mask whatever is really going on with me and they don't know what's going on with me nobody knows what's going on with me hey guys it's a little bit later i went from a six when i came to like it's like at an eight now like throbbing throbbing but she put some glue on it so this is the glue and it's drying now i could have got like a little stitch on it but she was like it won't that deep like i could have did the glue or the stitch so i just went with the glue and we're gonna go with that i'm just not gonna use my hand as often because i don't want it to like fade off so um, brush my teeth and wash my face. I ain't do no makeup today. Say hey, ma. Oh, girl, what's wrong? My hair. Um, you probably need some gloves. This cold air headed. It won't go over the stain right. Oh, your brace. You need some chunky gloves. Ooh. We leaving the hospital now. This wind ain't no joke. I turn that heat right on and put my um seat warm on when we get in this car. We ain't gotta go too far. Out of the street, and my mama crossing the street. I thought it was on this side of the street. <sighs> well, I'm discharged. I go follow up with the primary care on the 16th, and I got a uh, follow up with my regular clinic that I go to on the 7th, and then on the 9th, I go. <laughs> to do a mental health intake because I want to go see a counselor and a therapist so I'm going to be all up through these doctors <sighs> Jesus alright y'all let me go I'm coming okay, so I made it back home and I had to go to my handy dandy sour stop you want to come inside Marco or you want to stay outside Nicole he flew in here. Oh, the lighting bomb right here, but this is some sour sop, sour sop powder. It's a Caribbean powder. Some of you guys might be familiar with it, but this is what I'm going to test um, to lower my blood pressure. It was very, very elevated, and um, 
yeah so i'm gonna try this it says that it strengthens your immune system nerves supports blood pressure cholesterol sleep urinary tract and your kidneys use one teaspoonful daily maybe used for tea shakes smoothies drinks and in your general cooking so yeah and i think i got this from like a natural food store if i'm not mistaken but yeah honey michael is thirsty all right y'all so i'm getting my first glass down right now um i'm not gonna check right away i'll say i'll check in a couple of hours but all i did was add a teaspoon of the sour salt powder and i added a half a teaspoon of cinnamon that's probably a lot of cinnamon to y'all but cinnamon does have great benefits so i just put it in there and i had um a little bit of turbinado sugar i really didn't need the turbinado sugar i could have just drank it with the um cinnamon but yeah so it's really good y'all um it don't taste bad at all or look at in your own life again where perhaps you can be more principled where you can also be more disciplined and also stepping out of too much emotion and allowing yourself to go into the stream of logic because capricorn is black and white it doesn't have time for the fluff it's like what do we need to do how do we get it done let's stick to this plan let's execute for success because we are building into our opportunity. And even if an opportunity doesn't present itself to you, remember that you can always create opportunity for yourself. My tummy is like doing something crazy. I'm been having a day, but I'm about to make my second tea. Um, it's around seven right now. And I guess I will have the last one before bed since I got a late start. So I'm just going to use some of the tonic that the herbalist in Atlanta made for me. I'm going to use a half a teaspoon. <laughs> That's key. And then I'm going to use a half a teaspoon of the sour stop. Um, I could check my blood pressure to see if the sour stop did anything. But most people say to do it three times a day. So maybe I can check it like right before I go to bed. And then by that time, I would have been able to take a lot, like a relaxing bath. Um, I would have also had a chance to get my diffuser going. And um, I'm going to give you guys the formula that I'm using right now in my diffuser for my blood pressure. So that y'all can um, know which mixes that I'm doing. I think I shared with y'all on the last vlog, but I'm not 100% sure. So yeah, we'll see. You. Yeah. Yeah.